fashion are together on the table today for LDM's Culinary Masterpiece Project, taking place as part of the ALIA Conference 2016. Educators, scholars, and other participants at the Biennial ELIA Conference, European League of Institutes of the Arts, were welcomed to the Scuola di Cucina Lorenzo de' Medici inside the Mercato Centrale and the cooking classrooms of the LDM main campus, as well as the fashion department at Il Fuligno, for an interdisciplinary workshop focusing on art, fashion, and food. Participants got a chance to dive into regional colors and flavors through an interactive laboratory exploring the highest expressions of Italian creativity, guided by professionals in the fields of fashion, art, and cuisine. Divided in groups, the participants got a chance to produce individual handmade creations using only their instincts and an assortment of materials to guide them. In a way, they were experiencing the cornerstones of centuries-old Tuscan traditions and Florentine craftsmanship. The participants thoroughly enjoyed the experience. They were not quite sure what we had provided for them. So there was this sense of excitement. Uh, it was a challenge for them originally, but it stimulated their creativity in so many multi-sensory um, respects. And uh, they, they couldn't believe how much fun it was. It was almost as if it gave them an opportunity to release to this outlet for them because many of the participants did not come from a creative background. Um, and so it was a little bit challenging for them, but it's very interesting because when you are confronted in a situation like this, it brings out a part of you that you never knew existed. And I find this over the several decades of teaching and being involved in interdisciplinary um, partnerships that once you allow someone, a student, to explore and investigate some opportunities, they're astounded. Beginning in the culinary schools, each design team created a Tuscan dessert inspired by the group of artists known as the Macchiaioli. Each group's dessert had a different theme color to guide the creative process. The same color was used during the second session, which was a multidisciplinary experience and fashion workshop. Participants embraced their inner stylists by putting together an experimental fashion design using food and an assortment of odds and ends materials. We spoke with a few different groups to get an idea of what they enjoyed most about the activities. Didn't have an idea. We just started and this came out and everyone uh, grabbed a fruit or an apple or something. So it's really a collaborative uh, uh, effort <laughs> and um, well we think it's design and uh, I like the colors and uh, so we, it's ready. We don't uh, put uh, then this and this and this, oh, it's ready now so we stopped. <laughs> So it's a see-through, so you can look through it, it's transparent, but it still has the long, all the way to the ground figure. And now we're going to actually look in how we, maybe we can enhance the silhouette a little bit, because now it's like really like, you know, 20s, like 1920s all the way down, and now we have to make it a little bit sexy again. I think especially the, the combination, so the whole figure is going to... Uh, speak for itself now because there are two different handwritings in it and I try to avoid exactly what my colleague is doing so uh, let's say there's order there there's a bit of a chaos there there's one material there I try to use as much materials as possible there um, I'm trying to avoid food um, which is difficult but I found some pencils and I'm trying to um, humanize her. Curious about how they found the event to fit in with the rest of the ALIA conference, we asked for participants' thoughts on the cumulative experience. Uh, a very good experience and a very good way of getting to know colleagues that you have never met before. Um, and it's all about creativity, so I'm trying to be as creative as I can and have, having fun with it. I love making things, so that was a good um, that was a good change in the day because we were quiet and sitting down listening all day and then now you can make something that's really nice. It was an amazing day and um, my favorite was the workshop in the kitchen 
but also I heard very nice lectures, so it was also great. But the workshop was fantastic. It was was yeah, I cannot find words for it. It was really great to do that, to play with the food and uh, uh, to decorate it. Also, this workshop is really nice. It's fun, and you learn to know each other on other way yeah, than just sitting there and talking. It's like more interactive. It's like really being art schools with art schools together.